As Optimus continued to decode, Smokescreen walked up and announced his plans to become a great warrior like him someday. Bulkhead told him if he trained hard, it would happen. Smokescreen believed so as well, stating that it was his destiny. Following being questioned by RC, Smokescreen told the two that once being a data clerk and then becoming an ally of Optimus Prime ensured a potential great future for him. Smokescreen concluded that he had come a long way, also stating it was one opportunity he didn't plan on screwing up. After Optimus announced another Iacon coordinate had been decoded and Ratchet readied the ground bridge, Smokescreen told the group that whomever made it last to the Omega Key had to scrub the Energon tanks for a week before running off. He was disappointed when Optimus announced that RC and Bumblebee would go. After Smokescreen asked why he and Bulkhead had to stay, Optimus concluded that the two would stay behind at the chance he was able to decode another set of coordinates before RC and Bumblebee returned to the base. After RC and Bumblebee returned to the base after facing defeat at the hands of Knockout, Smokescreen concluded that he would be ready for the next Omega Key. After moving out of the way of a rather damaged RC, Bulkhead talked to Smokescreen. Smokescreen had the chance to prove himself when he and Bulkhead embarked to get the next Omega Key. As the two arrived on the scene, Smokescreen and Bulkhead readied their guns and walked next to each other. As they moved, the two started to hear suspicious ticking sounds near their location. Smokescreen confusingly asked what it was, to which a Decepticon came out of the bushes of the forest and proclaimed it would be the last sound he would ever hear. The Decepticon was identified as Dreadwing by Bulkhead and soon enough, the two faced another difficulty in dodging his bombs. While Bulkhead faced Dreadwing in a one-on-one -on -one match and defeated him, Smokescreen went to retrieve another Omega Key. As he opened the pod of which it was contained in, he grabbed it by its handle and continued to usher his belief in his destiny. However, the key was quickly snatched out of his hands as an individual struck him from the back and made off with the key. As he was awoken by Bulkhead, he concluded that something struck him and was disappointed to not have retrieved the key, reminding Bulkhead of his promise to Optimus. Bulkhead reassured him, by reminding him the group still had a key and without it, Cybertron wouldn't be resurrected. Smokescreen felt sad over his loss, before RC berated him for being so focused on himself and expressed her disdain that he was so determined about himself, rather than the team. As she continued to talk about him, Smokescreen deduced that he wasn't good enough for the team and drove out of the base. After he left, the Autobots discovered that he was the last Omega Key. As he returned to the base, he was attacked and defeated by Soundwave. 